How's it going everyone? It's Max Fisher here from A Better Universe. It's day 3 of 30. We're pushing on through it. It's your workout Wednesday, guys. So today we're talking about the perception. Like I always do with the yoga, guys. It's your perception that you're increasing. It's the impulses that you're increasing. It's your awareness of your body, your movement, and the uh, uh, bioelectric force that's going through your body that causes those impulses and sensations that we're trying to become accustomed to. So we have a greater understanding and knowledge of our body. Now it's workout Wednesday and some people might not consider yoga a workout, but uh, in, in a way it is, in a way it's not. It's supposed to be part physical, part spiritual, part mental, but it's a combination and it's, and it's really a body maintenance. It's an overall system haul. Uh, it's you know a way to keep up with the daily grind of life and uh, your regular fitness routine even if you use yoga as a supplemental routine use it to heal your body to stretch out to promote growth to increase that recovery time because after you stretch after you do yoga after you increase your perception and look in your body and uh, create space for growth you there's a certain sensation that you can feel in your body it's a wellness of uh, wellness of the energy being unobstructed and, uh, and uninterrupted in its flow through your body, which you know also promotes health, growth, and uh, physical well-being. And with that perception, with that uh, knowledge and awareness of your impulses in your body, you can recreate that in a visualization. And I've told you many a times, the brain doesn't realize the difference between a visualization and reality. So. In that said, if you don't have 15 minutes for yoga, maybe take 15 minutes while you're sitting at your desk if no one's going to notice, your boss isn't going to walk in on you, and visualize this feeling of what you would feel like after you did yoga or maybe how loose your body feels and that will actually help release tension in maybe your lower back or your neck or you know maybe you're having pains other places. But And don't just take my word for this guys, you have to bring it into your own experience too. It's uh, it's one thing to have knowledge, but when you ha when you hear somebody tell you something like this, you either have a choice to believe them or not. But once it's in your experience, you can say yes, that's true, or no, uh, that that's not, that didn't work for me, that just wasn't what I felt. So do your own due diligence, guys. And uh, with that said, let's get right into it. Come to the front of your mat, and I'll guide you through the rest.
almost there. Just take a moment, guys, after you're done. Close your eyes right into Dasana. Kind of just feel what's going on. Bring awareness to that bioelectric full force. Just realize your true potential for a moment. this brought some light to your day guys maybe a little heightened sense of awareness hope you feel calmer relaxed pleasant ready to take on the day this is max fisher from a better universe i'll see you guys on friday don't miss it